And while it's not officially spring yet, I hope you're ready for some warm, humid weather. We've definitely got it in the forecast. Not bad out there. The fog has lifted. We've got partly cloudy skies. There's a lot of sunshine peeking out with uh, a few clouds mixing in here and there. Hour by hour showing we're going to stay warm today into the upper 70s for most locations with a bit of a southwest wind. So that means the humidity is still going to be moving in. Now going into tonight, it is not going to be cold tonight. We're only going to drop into the mid 60s, waking up tomorrow morning still in the mid 60s with a bit of a wind uh, out of the southwest, only about three to five miles per hour. So more fog is expected tonight. This is the pattern where, yes, we are definitely going to see some fog. It will start along the coast. This is at 10 o'clock and watch how it creeps up to the north as we go throughout the overnight period. Waking up for your Thursday morning, we will likely have dense fog really across the entire area is what it's looking like at this point. So this could certainly impact your morning commute Thursday. So have extra time to get to where you need to be. It will start to lift and kind of clear out probably by 9, 10 o'clock, very similar to what we saw today. And then we're more than likely just going to do this all over again as we wake up Friday morning. Current temperatures, it is warm. 75 at the airport, 72 at Hammond. We've got 74 at Slidell, 72 at Gulfport. So everyone is in the lower to mid 70s this afternoon. We'll probably creep up a few more degrees with more of that sunshine coming out this afternoon. Not really expecting any rain today. The radar is clear here locally. You have to go all the way up in northern Mississippi before you start to see some of that rainfall and you can see the fog. You see how it kind of clears out as we go through. We get some of that daytime heating. Now most of the area is fog free. We're just seeing those partly cloudy skies. So this trend is going to continue as we go throughout today. Marine fog though, that's a problem and that's going to stick around probably throughout much of the day into tonight. The dense fog advisory for the marine areas goes until 10 a.m. tomorrow. It'll probably be reissued tomorrow afternoon as well. So we're dry today. We're dry through tomorrow. Rain chances below 10%. Friday does look like our best shot of rain, but look at that. Only a 20% chance of it across the area, and that's mainly on the North Shore and then sticking with about a 10% chance as we go into Saturday and Sunday. So our pattern is going to be very stagnant. No big changes. Look at these high temperatures staying near 80 degrees as we go throughout really the next seven days. Our average high for this time of year 71. So we are going to be running above average and with these warm temperatures, the humidity is going to be relatively high. So high pressure is controlling our weather. This is kind of a summertime setup when we have high pressure kind of situated over the southeastern part of the US just off the coast. This is going to keep all the cold fronts, all the weather makers really off to our north. So notice we've got the southerly flow that's going to continue as this high pressure stays off to our east. We will see a cold front by Friday into Saturday get very close, but with this high to our south, it's going to keep this cold front from pushing through. So it'll stall out to our north. And that's where the rain chances will be greatest Friday and into Saturday. They'll be north of us up towards Jackson and into northern uh, Mississippi over into Arkansas, Arkansas. That front kind of stays stalled out as we go throughout Friday and Saturday, so no big changes there. But notice all the cloud cover sticking around and really the same story even going into the weekend. This front will eventually wash out, so we're not going to get any reinforcing shot of cooler air, and it doesn't look like we're going to see less humid air anytime either. So a very spring like forecast. You can see here temperatures. There they are 80s for as far as the eye can see. We are going to be fairly dry today and tomorrow, but keep in mind and you'll notice each at the bottom of each uh, little icon. It says AM fog. That means we're likely going to have morning dense fog for most areas for out really the next six to seven days or so. So of course we're still in the fog season. Best rain chances on Friday, but only a 20% chance and mainly north of the lake. And then on St. Patrick's Day, you can see they're staying with the same pattern, lower 80s, 20% chance of showers.